last first week back to school ever of undergrad at least um and at least at parson which is where i currently attend i study photography and i minor in art and design history so uh so it's the first week back to school but it's actually thursday today so uh monday i don't have class and tuesday my class is online and i think i like took like a couple of clips that day um i was just mostly working on my computer the entire day and then on wednesday i had a 9 a.m class i got up super early walked myself to the train, went in, paid my 275, stepped into the train and pulled out my phone, and I saw four minutes ago, class was canceled that day. I could have saved myself 275, but I'm not complaining because I love to stay home. I am a homebody through and through. Anyways, today is Thursday and I was falling asleep last night and I was like, you know what? Where even is my class? So I quick peeked at my phone, let me see where this class is. And then I saw who the instructor was. There is no way on this godforsaken rock I am taking a class with this person again. There is no way. Not in this lifetime. I had a class with this person before. It was an online class and there was a lull in the conversation. There was nobody was talking. He had just like, you know, left it open. You know, you get the vibes, you know? It's the part where you like give a contribution to the conversation or you ask a question. So I put on my mic to ask a question, like to give a little a little two cents because it was so fucking awkward it was so quiet and i was like gonna say a little something and then ask a question i started talking i unmuted started talking this man went oh i think somebody didn't turn off their mic and muted me didn't even say like oh are you asking a question like we can't hear you no he just straight up muted me i was sh I, I was I was speechless and then a girl in the class was like i think Catherine was trying to ask a question and he was like, oh, sorry, and he tried to unmute me. And I was like, there is no way I am unmuting. Like, I, I, I. anyway, so I was like, there's no way I'm taking a class with this man. So thank goodness I found a class um, that could replace it, but it's a little bit inconvenient because it's like set, separated into two sections. So was the other one, but it was, it fit better into my schedule. But this one, there's five hours in between the sections. So like, what do, what do I do for five hours? I guess I'm gonna come home, but that also means it's gonna be a very long day. It's fine, as long as I don't have to take a class with that man. But while I was doing that last night, I realized that because a class that I had registered for was canceled last week, like fully canceled, like not gonna happen anymore, I don't have a replacement class to finish my minor because all the classes are filled up. And so I had a very big panic and I was ready to cry. And I emailed my academic advisor, a very depressing email, like, please help me. What am I gonna do? Which I regret now. I should have just waited till the morning to send that. <laughs> and it's even worse now because the only classes that are available that could fit into my schedule f to fulfill that credit are modern art history classes. I hate modern art. So I was looking through the courses and I found one that like, would work with my schedule and i would be interested in taking but it's full so i was like mm, let me try and be hopeful and see by the end of this week if any uh spots open up so i just gonna have to keep my eye on that and hope for the best <laughs> but anyways i shall get ready to go to class and live the long day ahead of me and tomorrow will be a really long day too because i have to go to the met after my morning class because um I have to go for my Tuesday class. I have to go look at some pieces there. So uh, it's just draining for a homebody like myself to leave ever. Anyways, I'm gonna go change now. Goodbye. <laughs>
this was 2159. 